Um, Michael Gold, um, the Chief of Cardiology and an Associate Dean of Interdisciplinary Clinical Programs. I'm the Michael Assey Professor of Medicine here at the Medical University of South Carolina. Uh, I've been in clinical practice as a cardiologist for 17 years now, uh, having previously trained at Harvard University and Mass General Hospital. I went to medical school at the University of Colorado. I've always been intrigued by cardiology because it's such a common and important area uh, of medical care. About 50% of patients will die uh, from cardiovascular disease, and about 80% of patients will have some heart disease uh, during their life. So it's a very important uh, area of study, and the electrical system of the heart's been something that's intrigued me for many, many years. The areas uh, that I've really focused my clinical practice and career around have been uh, the areas of heart rhythm or cardiac electrophysiology. So patients whose hearts are going too slow or too fast are the areas that we treat. And we treat those with a variety of techniques from uh, medications to ablation techniques where we can burn out uh, irritable spots in the heart to cure arrhythmia, arrhythmias to implanting pacemakers or defibrillators to treat heart rhythms or to make people breathe better and be able to walk further. I think a care philosophy in most areas need to be individualized for the patient, but I think this is particularly important uh, in the area of, of cardiac arrhythmias. Uh, there's not a lot of sort of cookbook approaches uh, to these patients, but for each individual patient, one needs to decide as to what medications might be useful, what non-medical therapy, uh, such as relaxation uh, or other sort of maneuvers, exercise may be useful for those patients. And then we often need to make important decisions about if a certain device or ablation technique can be used and what sort of approach would be, uh, would be best. So uh, we really try to individualize having the patient involved in that decision process to come up with the best solution for each patient. Well, I think any patient, when they're going to get care, particularly for an, an important and potentially dangerous health care problem, they need to know that they'll be at a place where they'll be caring, compassionate, and experienced physicians. I think at MUSC, our treatment for cardiac arrhythmias are second to none in the United States. Uh, we have by far the most experienced uh, crew here in uh, the low country as well as the whole state of South Carolina. Our physicians have over 50 years of experience uh, with taking care of heart rhythms. We have the largest center for arrhythmias and the most advanced equipment. But I think most importantly, we have a team of physician, nurses, and technicians who are dedicated specifically uh, to taking care of this group of patients from their simple initial outpatient visit to their most complex operative procedure. I think it's important, particularly when we work so hard and we're uh, often in stressful situations, that we relax when we get outside uh, of the hospital. So I've uh, been fortunate enough to live on the water, and my wife and I like to get out in the boat to relax or uh, often enjoy playing tennis as a way of getting some exercise and trying to stay heart healthy. For more information about this physician or services at the Medical University of South Carolina, call 1-888-792-4990 or go to muschealth.com.